In this video, we will determine an exponential function given two points using the T84. We are asked to determine the equation of an exponential function passing through 1 comma 6 and 3 comma 27 eighths. We are asked to indicate the initial value and if the function represents exponential growth or decay and then finally determine f of 2. We begin by entering the ordered pairs into the T84. We enter the x values in list 1 or L1 and we enter the y values or function values in L2 or list 2. Going to the calculator, we press stat and then enter. We need to clear the old ordered pairs or old data by going to the top of the column and pressing clear and then enter. So we press up, clear, enter. Go up to the top of L1, clear, enter. And now we enter the x values in L1, which are 1, enter, 3, enter. Right arrow, the y values or function values in L2, which are 6, enter, and 27 divided by 8, enter. And now we go back to the home screen by pressing second mode for quit. And now we need to perform exponential regression. We press stat, right arrow wants to calculate, Exponential regression is option zero, so if we scroll past nine at the bottom, notice option zero is EXPREG, which is exponential regression. We press enter, and now if you have an older T84, you might not see this screen here. You can simply press enter to perform the exponential regression. On this version of the T84, we arrow down to calculate, and then press enter. The exponential function is in the form of y equals a times b raised to the power of x, where a is equal to eight and b is equal to 0.75. Let's record this information. We now know that a is equal to eight and b is equal to 0 0.75, which as a fraction is equal to 3 fourths. We can use the fraction or the decimal because both are exact. And for a quick review, to convert a decimal to a fraction on the T84, we enter the decimal, press math, enter, enter, which does give us 3 fourths. So now we know the exponential function is f of x equals a, which is 8, times b raised to the power of x, which is 3 fourths raised to the power of x. a is the initial value and therefore the initial value is eight. Notice here the base is equal to 0 0.75 or 3 fourths, which is between zero and one, and therefore the exponential function represents exponential decay. When b is greater than one, we have exponential growth. So we have exponential decay. And finally we're asked to determine f of two. We determine f of two by substituting two for x, which gives us eight times three fourths raised to the second power squared. Let's go ahead and evaluate this on the calculator. We enter eight times three divided by four or three fourths. To enter the exponent of two, we can use the squared key here or the exponent key here and then two. Let's just use the squared key, enter. So f of two is equal to 4.5 or as a fraction, we press math, enter, enter, 4.5 is equal to 9 halves. So again, we can express f of 2 as 4.5 or 9 halves. I hope you found this helpful.